Praise the Lord, brothers and sisters, body of Christ, bride of Christ. This is the prophetess of the Most Highest God. And today is November 2nd, 2022. Yep, brothers and sisters, it looks like we made it this far for 2022. But don't give up hope. Don't give up trust. And don't you dare give up faith. For the Lord Jesus Christ, our blessed hope, is on his way. And we must stand strong and firm and diligent on this promise that Jesus made us in John 4, 14. Um... John 14, 1 through 6, where he says, Be not troubled. You believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. If we were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again to receive you unto myself. Where I am, ye may be also. Where I go, ye know, and the way, ye know. For I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one cometh unto my Father but through me. Brethren, as we see the head of the snake showing up right now in 2022, we are seeing the tribulation but we will not be here brethren don't give up faith trust and hope in Jesus for what he says he will do brethren hold tight hold tight to God's righteous right hand that's what he tells me all the time to hold on tight to his righteous right hand, for he is with us now and forever, and will be with us till the end of the age. Brethren, I know many of you right now are giving up, but please do not give up. Do not give up. Jesus is God in the flesh, and you know what he says in his word he has brought to pass. So believe that we're going to be caught up to be with him for all eternity. Brethren, yes, we see all the things that are happening in this world. But we are not in chaos. The world is in chaos. We are in the hands of the Almighty. Hallelujah. Praise God. We are in the hands of the Almighty. And He tells us in His Word. If we abide in His Word. And He abides in us. Ask what you will. And He shall give it to you. He is our provider, not the government, not, not our parents, no one. He is our provider. He is our Jehovah Jireh. He provides everything that we need. Everything. It's not your husband's and it's not your wife's, nor your children's if they are adults. It is Jesus Christ, Jehovah Jireh, our provider. So brethren, stay strong in the spirit by walking in the spirit and denying the lust of your flesh, denying all that the world is trying to give unto you. You know that you are not of this world. You are only passing through you are ambassadors of Christ, and Jesus dwells within you. As the Holy Spirit 
brings you through the difficulties of this world. Yes, many of us are going through trials and tribulations, but praise God, hallelujah, thank you Jesus, that he is the one that is bringing us through the difficult times. If you are going through difficult times, lean upon Jesus, not upon your own understanding, but in all his ways, acknowledge him, acknowledge him, acknowledge him, and he shall direct your path. Brethren, it is getting closer and closer and closer and closer and closer to the catching away of the bride and the body of Christ. I have a 33 year old daughter and God came to her in a vision a couple of days ago and told her that it is nigh, it is nigh, it is nigh, hallelujah. He is coming to take his children home for the things that are happening all around us shows that we our redemption praise God is drawing closer and 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 closer to going home so I am here today to say don't give up strive for perfection strive to make it to heaven those are the words of our father who has said strive for perfection brethren I know that many are going through very difficult times but hang on hang on hang on he will not let you go he will never leave you nor forsake you, but hold on to him. Hold on to our blessed hope. Brethren, this is from the Holy Spirit. Be blessed. Shalom. And we are out of here. Hallelujah. We are out of here. Praises unto our King of Kings and Lord of Lords. We are out of here. Maranatha. See you in the air. Be blessed. Body of Christ. Jesus is soon to come. The scripture says. For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout with the voice of the archangel and with the trump of God and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. So shall we ever be with the Lord. He will come when you least expect it. He could come today. He could come tomorrow. He could come anytime. We must be ready.